the play going on right now is about how to stop bullying and not spoil anymore because that's really bad at me. As we've been learning last year, if you see someone getting bullied, you should always go tell the teacher. Hey, I think the play's starting. Come on! Bullying is when someone feels the need to feel stronger by someone else by picking on or tormenting them over and over again. Because we're going to go over the first rule against bullying. We will not bully others! I'm here with my two friends, Ricky and Samantha. Mean words are bullying. Uh, mean faces are bullying. These are gestures of bullying. Like, or... <clears throat> Calling names and pushing and shoving and pinching and biting and kicking and all that stuff. Okay, okay, words do hurt, okay? Whoever said that sticks and stones may break my bones, but names will never hurt me, only got half the story right. We will try and help students who are being bullied. We're gonna try to help students who are being bullied, that is so important. Hey, get out of my way. Hey, don't bully her, that's not nice. If you don't know the person, just um, sit down with them and try to be their friend if they're down. We have a third rule. Yeah, we will include students who might be left out. We're going to try to include students who are left out. If you ever see somebody sitting on a bench or is lonely, then go, go see if you can go say hi and meet them, even you know, if you have no clue who they are. And always be nice to people when and never bully. And if you ever see someone getting like bullied or if you see someone bullying someone, go tell an adult. If we know someone is being bullied, we will tell an adult at school and an adult at home. Tell me. I'd rather not say. You'd rather not say. You'd rather just keep it to yourself. <laughs> no. Keeping things to yourself is not gonna solve any problems. I don't care, I don't want to talk about it or about bullying, and I'm not alone. Jerry, there are more than six million kids out there, and most of them have been picked on or bullied or forced to do things that they don't want to do, and they mostly keep it to themselves. That's not a good thing, Todd. I've got bullied once, and um, I felt really bad, and I told the teacher, and it was the right thing to do. Which is different than tattletelling, because telling takes go box out bullying peace shaking hands is the one of the things of opposite of bullying and hugging is one of them too sharing is showing that you care for them and it's the opposite of bullying i'm pleasing here thanks yeah you're a great friend Listening to someone is also being friendly and caring. Did you hear that um, that Kennedy's having a sleepover this Saturday? And remember, you want to be treated nicely, and everybody wants to be treated nicely. And remember, everybody's different, so um, don't make fun of them because that could turn them into a bully too if they want to get if they get back at you so don't get back at people that'll turn you into the bully too remember, remember to box out bullying bye